Hi everyone, this is Bailey Everett with Mendix, and today I'll be showing you how you can integrate a Mendix application with your Salesforce.com instance, utilizing the Salesforce.com connector available in the Mendix App Store. First, let's take a look at an application built entirely on the Mendix platform. It's your standard order entry product management application. We have a dashboard on the landing page representing the data visually. And we also have a list of all the orders that exist within the system. Now, let's say that we wanted to associate this order with a customer or account that resides in my Salesforce.com instance. Typically, adding this type of functionality with traditional delivery methods might take hours, if not days. Today, I'll show you how you can do it with Mendix in minutes. Let's transition to the business modeler of the Mendix app platform. In the Mendix business modeler, you build applications using visual models. You can create any data model you like, easily build user interfaces for desktops and mobile devices, and use our signature microflows to build complex functionality and business logic all in a visual manner. Apps are automatically checked for consistency and can be deployed with a single click in the cloud, so you can take a look at your application right away. The first thing we need to do is download the Salesforce.com connector from the Mendix App Store. If we take a look at the domain model of this newly added module, we can see a list of all the fields that are returned from Salesforce out of the box. This could easily be extended with additional attributes or objects, including custom ones that exist within your Salesforce instance. We need to add the necessary credentials so that we're connecting directly to our Salesforce instance. Now that we've added our credentials, we can go ahead and extend our order entity in our domain model. As part of this demonstration, the data that's retrieved from Salesforce will be added to our Mendix application. So I need to add some additional attributes. One called search term, which will be the query of the account that we're passing into Salesforce. The account ID that's returned from Salesforce. The account name. And the account's phone number. Then we can go to the order edit screen and add this new functionality. We'll create some additional sections to add this new data. And then we'll add the additional fields that we added to our order entity. We'll make the account name and account phone non-editable as we don't want the user actually changing them. We also want to create a new page that renders all the results that are returned from Salesforce. We'll also need to create a microflow to show that page. And we want to pass in the order entity as again it contains our search term. Then the last thing we need to do is extend the query accounts microflow. As you can see, what it's currently doing is obtaining the settings, creating a search term, attempting to log in, and then calling the web service. If any errors or issues exist, it will log them accordingly. 
You need to extend this by adding the order entity. And also, update our search query. And then we can save everything and redeploy the application to see how it now functions within the browser. I'm deploying locally here, but we could deploy to a sandbox with the free Mendix Community Edition, or the Mendix Cloud, or even on-premise with Mendix Business Editions. Going into an existing order, we can see the ability now to search Salesforce. Let's try to search for only one account, Wayne Enterprises. We also want to add the ability to select this account and add it to our order. So let's go ahead and implement that. In our results page, we'll add a new button that will trigger Microflow. Let's also update the page title accordingly. And then we'll create our new Microflow. Lastly, we'll just close the pop-up. And then since we created a new microflow, we need to update the security model accordingly. Save everything and let's redeploy and see how it now functions. We'll type in Wayne, search for it. And now we can select it and it's added accordingly to our order object. Thanks for watching this demonstration of Mendix for Salesforce.com. The Mendix app platform offers a fast and adaptable way to build secure and scalable applications on top of Salesforce.com. Get started for free with the Mendix Community Edition at now.mendix.com.